So if you don't know of the VCV host, it's an official commercial module that allows us to use VST instruments and effects within VCV Rec, and it just got a new free update, the ability to send out MIDI from a VST, so sequences, modulation, gates, and so on. Here I have a small example that we can have a look at. I have here the first voice which is basically Terraform going through some delay, but I'm using the Stokes sequencer. This is a free sequencer, by the way, a VST sequencer with uh, probability options and quite uh, interesting um, features. So this is sequencing via the host to CV module or expander, I should say, and this expander should come from the right of the module and you can chain also expanders so this expander has pitch gate and velocity that i'm using in this case it has also of course aftertouch and um, pitch wheel mod wheel and so on clock even if you have a sequencer that outputs a clock right so i'm using again this sequencer this midi sequencer this VST MIDI sequencer to sequence Terraform. Another example I have here are some chords. This is coming from Basel, again going through some delay. And in this case I'm using Scalar 2. I have the demo, I downloaded the demo just for this video because I know that uh, people are interested in using Scalar 2 in VCV. So here I have a chord progression going on. And this is sequencing polyphonically in the right click menu of the host to CV. We can choose how many channels. So this is sequencing polyphonically, something I forgot to show you before. Um, of course, you can sync also the sequencer to VCV. If you right click one of the slots here, of the host module, you can see uh, you have all sorts of transport controls. So you have clock inputs, pause, continue, stop, and reset. So I'm using the clock and the reset to sync this stochastic sequencer and also the chords. I'm triggering the chords with the clock from VCV. This is also, I'm splitting also uh, the first note into another basal, which, which is side-chained to the kick drum that we will uh, listen to in a second. So let's bring in the bass. Right, so we have even a chord progression. Another example, here I'm using a gate sequencer or a rhythm sequencer, and I have the host to gate expander connected. So this will output gates, and here I have this lovely Euclidean sequencer. And this is also the free version, so it will, it's not the free version, it's the demo version, so it will stop playing after a while, but never mind, just for this example. So we have a kick, hi-hats, and a snare. Again, I'm syncing it with the clock from VCV. And this is quite an interesting uh, sequencer. I know there are Euclidean sequencers in VCV that are also really interesting, but uh, it has a few more features. Maybe you like it. Uh, probability. Um, you can sequence the velocity. You can all do all sorts of things. Uh, humanize everything, add swing. Randomize stuff. You have macros, you have LFOs here if you want to use them. This is also quite an interesting sequencer. And we have also velocity for the host gate. We have also velocity mode. In this case, I'm using it because there is also velocity control in this sequencer. And you might notice, if I zoom in a bit, that the gates are in different levels. You see this gate, for example, is at a lower level than this gate. So basically what you have to do if you want to use um, velocity, you just have to send those gates also to a VCA. 
and this will control the velocity of the signal if you want this. So you have also velocity control. There is also another expander, the host to see uh, CC. I don't have and I couldn't find any uh, VST um, that might send modulation and stuff like this. Maybe uh, something like Gatekeeper, although now we have the Mind Melt Shape Master, but something like this can send out also modulation. And this is basically it. So you can send out MIDI. This was a short video. You can send out MIDI from host. You can send sequences, modulation, uh, rhythm sequences. And, and that's it. And I hope you will enjoy it. Again, this is a free update. The host module is commercial, but this is a free update. So go and have fun. <laughs>